Hey guys, before we continue with the video, I wanted to show you guys a wallet that Carbon Mod was nice enough to send out to me. They wanted me to do a full review on it, and before I gave you guys a review, I wanted to make sure that it was an honest review, so I waited a few weeks for, of me using the wallet, and everything has been good. Nothing has actually went wrong with the wallet itself. Everything works flawless, and I received compliments on it as well. So it's a small and sleek uh, compact look and as you guys can tell it's a carbon fiber uh, finish. So you can get these in black but you can also get it in red, blue or uh, like a chocolate color. You have a little clip here where you can put your cash. I typically don't really carry cash that often but I have used it before and you know I had no issues with the money falling out. I've actually stuck a receipt in here and it never slid out. So what it has is a little clip right here at the bottom which let's see if I can do it with my left hand. You just lift that up and then you have all your cards pop up. And then what you can do is, I find this um, kind of neat because you can just slide one of them at a time and kind of just go down the list on, and then just get whatever you guys want. So you can fit about 10 cards in here maybe. I do have uh, one, of a car one of my cards that's actually for work, but I think that's about three cards thick. So um, I want to say roughly between maybe 10 and 12 cards, regular cards that you can fit in here. If you guys are interested in getting one of these, I do have a discount code for you guys, which is gonna be L15. I'll have a link in the description down below. If you guys are interested in ordering one, you can get yourself one. Now let's go ahead and continue with the video. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm gonna to be letting my girlfriend drive the E36 for the first time. I think she's had some practice before back in the day, but she hasn't really driven in a while. So we're gonna see if she still has it or if she actually knows how to drive. But the clutch is a stage 2 clutch, so it's going to be a little bit stiffer than what a normal E36 would be. So we'll just see how it turns out. Just go ahead and adjust your seat. So, do you know the actual basics or do you remember the basics? Put your foot on the brake. Alright, so you don't have to press the clutch now. Let go of the yeah, e-brake. The e now, remember, if you go too far to the left and up, that's actually going to be reversed. So, just kind of put it to the left and then up because you can actually push it more. But you got to press the clutch in. Right, now, go ahead. That should be first. And now just um, let go of the brake completely and start let, um, start letting go of the uh, the clutch very very slowly. Now give it a guess. Ah, right. uh, you got it. <laughs> All right, so just kind of go around. And then once we go straight again, um, I want you to switch into uh, second gear. Give a guess. Switch. Ah, shit! <laughs> So stop, um, push the clutch and uh, stop here? Yeah. Get your foot in break? Yeah. Alright, put it back in first and take off again. Ah. <laughs> yeah, I think you're in first now, so try to try it again. You had it. 
It's just a matter of getting the feel of where the clutch is at. Start giving it gas a little bit. There you go. So if you feel it, it's starting to kind of like choke, push on the clutch real quick. And that'll prevent it from actually choking. That's so short! Is that as far as it'll go up? Yes! You sure? Mm-hmm. <laughs> yes! It's hurting my, um... Your foot? No, like in the back of my... Oh, the calf? My... Your calf muscle? My knee. Bro, what are you talking about, man? There's something underneath my leg. Uh. That works. I go back and make a right. right? Yeah, right here. And then turn left right here. Cut through there, cut through there. Give it guys. Switch. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> so you can let go of the brakes, remember, I mean the clutch, you don't have to be pressing the clutch out while uh, you were still in gear. No, you were in. Yeah. yeah, you were in. You were in fourth, I think. Fourth. That's what I felt. Like. I don't know. Or third. Might have been third. Right. Go ahead. Take off again. Remember, you're going to second. So go around and go that way again and give it gas and then actually switch this. So like as long as you once you know the basics, it's not that hard. I told you, oh my god! <laughs> now that you have an audience. <laughs> oh my goodness! You're like, hang, I don't want to cross through her. Okay, yeah, one more try. There's not a car behind you because then you're really gonna get nervous. <laughs> Alright, go ahead. Give it a guess. <laughs> oh my goodness! You're doing good over there. I oh, know. Okay, you're starting to get a little nervous. There you go. Alright, right, now let's see you go in the third. Yeah! <laughs> I got a 
pedal learned in case I ever, you know, twist my ankle and need somebody to drive. <laughs> From second to first. <laughs> Luckily, your RPMs weren't that high. Uh, had to stop. <laughs> it was ready to take off. Give a guess. More. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having her do a pull real quick, but from the outside, so hopefully she doesn't stop. Alright guys, well that's going to do it for today's video. Do me a favor, hit that like button if you enjoyed this video. And if you haven't already, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Can't really see her, but peace. Bye. <laughs>